This is going to change how you file your PNP with Ontario government. If you don't know about this, Ontario government immigration program has recently changed the way you access your OINP account. The new way to access the account is through the My Ontario account and the old way to access the account was through one key account. So if you are planning to file your PNP with Ontario or if you are already in process with your PNP in Ontario, then you need to migrate your one key account to My Ontario account. And in this video, I'm going to give you step-by-step -step guide on how to do that so you don't struggle. And I know that a lot of you are struggling with some of the technical issues while migrating the account. So I'm going to cover that as well in this video. So please watch the video till the end. It's a very short video and I'll make sure that it's worth for you. So let's get started. The link to start this process is in the description. So please go check that out and we'll start the process right now. So first of all, as we know that there is one section for the new user, but we'll go for the returning user because new user is easy. So first of all, in this process, you will have to create your my Ontario account and to do that you will have to first go to this page and then click on create account and enter your respected email and password it should be exactly same as what you have used while creating your OINP one key account please make sure that the email address is not changed of course the password can be whatever you wish it should be once you agree the terms and click on create the account a verification mail will be sent to your email address go check out your email address and click on activate the account so once you click on start activation it will lend you to the page where you'll have to click on complete activation and it will lend you to the page of your Ontario OINP account just sign in regularly as you do and you will be taken to the screen where it's basically asking you to enter your one key ID and password to migrate your one key account to my Ontario account. Now make sure this is one key ID and password, not your my Ontario account, which you just created. Okay, so please do that and click on migrate. You might get this kind of error message which says that sorry, we could not find a match for the information you provided, which means that your one key ID and the password is wrong, which you previously used. And in this case, you will have to remember uh, if you cannot access the account, you will have to contact the Ontario nominee at Ontario.ca uh, to get more information about this. But for most people who remembers their username and the password, that should be it. Now, once you click on migrate, it will migrate your account. Now, as you can see, it will look very similar to your one key account where you can access your files and your uh, ONP existing uh, application as well as the process. But it is not your existing one key account. It is actually your my Ontario account you can look at the corner of the screen here to make sure that yes it is indeed the my ontario account and the other way to make sure that you have already migrated your account is go into this my ontario account link from the corner and once you go there you will be able to see ontario immigration nomination program in your my apps section if that is done then you know that everything is good and you are all set with your migration and it's completed if there are any technical issues in this case you will have to immediately contact the Ontario government on the email address I mentioned. I'm also putting that email address in the description to make it easy for you. And please feel free to comment down here if you have any further information about this or if you have any questions and I will try my best to help you out. Also, if you want to file your PNP application or are in the process of your PR journey, please do consider subscribing to the channel. And if you are confused on finding the right way to get a PR in Canada, please feel free to book an appointment with me and let's chat about it. So I hope this video was helpful and I will see you in the next one.